Uh, what do you want to start this off with? I'm the Is greatest anything? wrestler. Okay. We are going to go in three, two, one. What is up, everyone? Welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda. CM Punk to the past. Nil princess. <laughs> Come back, CM Punk. Just why have why hast thou forsaken us? Uh. We're starting off this episode talking about a wrestler that two of us have never ever watched a match of. Pretty much. It's pretty great. Uh, anyway, we have unfinished business in the Temple of Time, even though Armagoma is dead. Yes. We have, uh, there's something. Somewhere that we're supposed to not that. A blue ruby! Oh Holy man, shit. unfinished business complete! Alright, well, we got all the all the things that I like. Seneca, bring back CM Punk. Promise of a lifetime. Yep. You know how that works. Did you move the wrong statue? Nope, I weren't moved the right one. But you decided to move both of them just because? Well, <laughs> if you notice why the I moved that one, uh, I didn't remember him. Oh, the him. fairy. <clears throat> that's not a fairy. Back behind that? No, that's not a fairy. Is that golden bug? Oh, that is indeed not that either. I don't know what you're talking about, then. Oh, you'll see in a minute. I'm sure I will. You need one more piece of heart. But you're already at 11, so what could you possibly need with more heart pieces? We turned it Oh, up I'm to sorry, 11. that Dark Knight. Uh, that Dark Knight almost killed you, so that's why you would need more. Because you were trying to be fancy. Oh, it's a Poe. It is Poe. I didn't see the lantern. Or rather, I confused it for two objects that, that it was it not. Was clearly not. That's, that's you <laughs> being clearly wrong. You sound a lot clearly. like Dennis right now. Clearly. I'm always sunny. Clearly. You bitch! <laughs> I am a five star man! <laughs> you watch Always Sunny? No. Ah, oh, man, you have to get I on mean, that. Let me rephrase that. I do. But this not... season has been hot fire. Dylon? Dylon, 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 Dylon. Okay, well, let's go and figure out what we gotta do next. You know, uh, Midna somehow knew what we were supposed to do, but. We gotta curl Link's arms using some logs, black uh -oh. out the pain, and build your body. Or we gotta talk to this freaky whatever the fuck it is. Oh, Uku. See. Uku sees what she was looking for. It's the Dominion Rod. Yeah, it's been around for quite some time. His magic, His magic has been exhausted. Ah. So what is the Dominion Rod supposed to be? Actually. I don't know. Because it's referring to something ancient, like one of the rods you get in the past game. Z the only rod... <laughs> no, that Link to the Past has those two magic rods. But yeah, but they're fire and ice. Oh, they are indeed. Yeah. There are, there are lots of rods in Zelda, but... Wait a minute! Nope, 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 we're wrong... We're wrong. We're rewinding that sentence. There are many rod items in various Legend of Zelda games. There are not, as some allegations have recently uh, leaked, there are not many rods in Zelda. There is only one, the Royal Rod. Oh, right. The Dominion Rod is useless. Oh, that's, that's what... It's not useless. You still use it for oh. a bunch of stuff. Not for a while. No, like almost immediately, actually. You use it a ton to get to City in the Sky. Well, yeah, but... Well, you have to go back to... Uh, Telma's Bar, I think? Yeah, to Is it for the last time? Yeah, because Telma's so Bar doing? is gonna... Actually, um, I'm gonna switch that out because I don't need the Dominion Rod for a little while. Um, the Dominion Rod is completely useless because the... Oh my god, stop mowing grass and warp. What, um, how would you, what would you refer to that as, where traveling through the gate did not affect, uh, Nil, but affected, uh, the Dominion Rod? Oh, I wanna... I don't know that there's a singular word that describes that. <laughs> yeah, because... So the, Domin the Dominion Rod's magic, through, yeah, for it, now, has diminished. Well, when it traveled through time, it acted as if it had just been sitting there, like, it... It aged. Yeah, it actually it aged. Even it aged Link autonomously. I, I don't quite understand why it would have done that, but who cares? Well, because Link came to the past from the future. So shouldn't he have Whereas, come? So we should have been pl playing babies? as a placenta. Yes. 
No. Oh, yes. I think this Absolutely letter might be important. Not. I think this letter might be important. It's probably somebody who like, oh, come to deliver a letter. For yes, this is actually an important letter. If you don't know what you're doing, which I do, so eh. Uh, Renato is the dude back in Kakariko. The one who the did. guy who looks like a, a he, he, weird Native American. He found the item in which I need to fix, right? Yeah. Well, you go back to Renato's house, and Ilya is back there. And she remembers me. No. You gotta fix her. When she is the item you have to fix. Uh, so she I think is, it's- I think the order, though, is tell Ms. Barr, and then you, you go are back you telling to me I need? Are you telling me I need to fix, uh, Link and Ilya up to, into an item? Yes. Well, they were an item until so she this, came down with amnesia. So is this- is These this, are the dudes who hit your dog! Those fuckers. The guy's carrying... So, Nondescript on. items on their shoulder. Hold on, is this the part of Twilight Princess where it becomes a, uh, a, a girlfriend simulator like Grand Theft Auto San Andreas? When did San Andreas become that? I don't know that I played that part there is of it. A, you, you cannot progress in the game unless you do the very last one. Oh. You have to, in order to rob the casino, you need... Oh, wait, no, you, you can buy... You don't have to rob the casino. Yeah, I never do any of those fucking dating side games. Oh, it was boring. Except the ones you have to do, and they're usually pretty short and painless. So, what, we have a Shay... Uh, Russell, and who else is here? I can't remember the other guy's name. Shad, no, Shad is in Kakariko. Shad's the dude who I think is examining the statues in Renato's basement. Shadows? Statues? No, you said statues. Okay, okay, I'm getting paranoid because sometimes I just say words that don't make any sense, like underwater metro. Why doesn't that make sense? Because it's underground. Oh, no, because they, <laughs> you know there's a train tunnel yeah. between uh, England uh, and France. I was going to say between here and Virginia, but yeah. No, there's a train tunnel between here and, f between, yeah, between here and France. Oh, wow, I would be down to see this train. Oh, I would, be I would nice run that train. nice if I could train. just take the train from New Jersey to France. No, it wouldn't. It would be, what, you're saying you don't like France? You're connecting one shithole to another. Wow! Oh my god! I'm in America Fran and France. French listener base? Woo! Dropping off. American listener base? Woo! Oh man. Um, also UK, German, Australian, and Canadian. No, we got all, all the top fives just disappearing. They're oh, all wow, just, when did I get three subscribers? They're all just... They're all just gonna be like, wow, Mike hates everyone. Yeah, you're right, Mike what hates What an equal everyone. opportunity racist. I'm not just... I mean, oh my god, let's, let's just get the fuck off this topic. So we're back at Kakariko Village. Uh, we haven't really talked to Ilya in a bit. When we last left her off, she was on that caravan with Tomo. When we last got her off. Um, yeah, we're getting off of that one, too. Oh god, she's like... Uh, Zombied out. Oh she's shit. She's taking too much Ambien. Uh-oh, is the killer kill dead? No, I wanted to kill her. Okay. Because that is a zombie. That is clearly... That is a zombie. Why are you looking at... <laughs> Fuck no, I didn't talk to the shaman. Is that what he is? Is he really a Native American stereotype shaman? Oh. Yeah, he Oh, is. god damn it. Why? Why the magical mystery Native American? I don't know. Smiled upon us. Is that a line from one of the the South? It's a really cliche line, but is it also part of the uh, the the La Resistance song? I don't Fortune remember. has smiled upon us this day. <sighs> yeah, Renato's letter carefully details how to treat Ilya to get her memory back. Okay, let's read this carefully detailed letter to see how to get her memory back. Now, hold on. Don't I have to uh, acquisition uh, the whatever? Uh, you. The letters right there. Uh, so first how about off, you? Well, he was telling you... <laughs> no, you go to Kakarika. There's the doctor there. Uh, before you do that, go down to the basement. Oh my god, why are you showing because these Because it's an item! They can't read it! Fuck. You think- you think Gorons are literate? Damn! Call me racist. Oh shit, 
Oh shit. Actually. Uh I think that's Shad. Is. You can't do that. Why not? No, just talk to him. Just look, turn your ass around and speak with him. Well, you got pointy elf ears. What a coincidence meeting you and I. What the fuck? Sky being is called the Uka. Perfect timing. Oh, an extraordinary fellow. Observe this statue. It's the same as the one in my manuscripts. There's similar similar statues around Hyrule. Here, look at the belly. This is my father's notes. Waken us, the world that the word that breaks the seal. Wait a moment. Is that Ilya? Simply tragic how she lost her memory. The rod of the heavens she mentioned. I'm sure it has something to do with the word that breaks the seal. Isn't there any way to restore her memory? Oh, son of a bitch. Yeah, this is just to talk to him. Oh, He's son like, of hey, a what's bitch. Up? Go to go warp to Kakariko. You should be fine warping here. Or can you not warp inside? I'm in Kakariko. Or not Kakariko, I meant a castle town. You know what I mean. A castle town? There's multiple? Yeah, go to castle town. Why is that a door? I don't know. That's some dumb shit. Yeah. Okay. Open this fucking You know door. you're going to have to go through hoops to, to warp now. <sighs> Please, don't remind me. You remember I... back in the day when you just fucking start playing some dumbass music and everything's fine? No, nobody gives a fuck about life. Wow. That's I because everyone some... in Termina is depressed, is like you. Yeah, I am on some depressing shit and I'm not even depressed. Apparently, yeah. You're making me depressed. I'm sorry. Let's all be depressed together. Have a good old depression party. No, let's not. No, let's not do that. Let's not at all do that. Let's never do that. <laughs> Although, can you really have a depression party? I, I mean, is it called a party? Or is it called a funeral? Wow! Oh! Giving you some claps for that. That was terrible. That was great. No, you, you not. have no idea how genius that was. <laughs> Can't wait to go to my next depression party. Oh, wait a minute, I can. <laughs> oh, fuck. Ring, ring. Hey. Yeah. So and so just died. Oh, that's really sad. Yeah. So, uh, what time's the depression party? Is there gonna be- is there gonna be an open bar? Open bar goes really well with a depression party. I'm assuming I gotta show this to Telma, who's gonna tell me where the fucking hidden village is. No, there's a step between that. There's a doctor. I actually... yeah, you do see the doctor. This hidden village comes later. But what about... Your step's removed from that. Well, that was the only thing I remember, because I remember it was a pain. What are you doing? Are do you... you remember having to get the scent of the medicine? Lazy guard. Fat. Fat too. Yeah, fat fuck. Tisk tisk. I'll figure it out. No, Why I know I know what to do. If I was fucking Link, like if I was Link, I would probably be. This open house, with I think, is in one of those back alleys near uh, the, the throughway near where Agatha's castle is. So what up? It's from Renato. He doesn't bother to mention me. A little rude. There's no accounting for the foolishness of a man. At least I understand and lend a hand for the adorable little girl. What else do I know? Uh, it was the doctor? Maybe you know something. Rusty old bat, got honey. God damn, why do you go through the important stuff so fast? Not the invoice. I'll figure it out. Yeah, that's why you go to Telma. Well, I remember generally where Oh god, this is the Goron Sword fucking quest. Is it? Well, I mean, it's just a fetch quest. Not every fetch quest is a Goron Sword quest. One's where you exchange items over and over again. Well, I mean, like, in that sense, then the Goron Sword is the, the Tempered Master Sword quest. Well, that's what the that's what the Goron Sword acts as, and it is. That's yeah. my point, though. Oh uh, no! So the doctor said, "No, it. it's pretty yeah, sure. yeah, fortune telling." No. Yeah, it's one of these houses back in this alley. I don't think it's this alley. It might be the one across. Yeah, I think it's that one over across. See that way. Okay. Well, you know the general area. Uh, so you go, and I think you show him. My the uh, the invoice that you just got. He's like, no, someone stole the medicine or something. The cats took it. The thousands of screeching oh, cats in my yeah. alley. Oh yeah, that's this is the dude with the cats, right? Uh, Giovanni. Jo is Giovanni the doctor? Yeah. God, yeah, yeah, yeah. You dig your way in. He doesn't have the medicine, and then you have to like um push something out of the way. 
and get the scent of the medicine. Mr. Gengel. So his name is Giovanni Gengel? No, that's the that's the cat. cat. That... And you scroll through the text so damn fast. Giovanni's house. Wait a minute. These is people this... need to secure oh. their... Oh, this is him. Yeah, I knew Giovanni sounded familiar. There's still need six more. Come on. Just give it up. Give up the ghost. How the hell did I end up there? What does give up the ghost mean? Die? Maybe? It came up in Resident Evil Remake recently. The forest gave up the ghost. Why the hell are these cats all about me as a wolf? I don't know. Maybe you... You got some good oh, stink on you. Oh, God. Like, you got that, that, that Pizza Hut cardboard box stink on you. Oh, God, that... that... It smells like farts for no reason. There's no justifiable reason for a cardboard pizza that box was... to smell like that. This is... I think this is the doctor. Uh, check the sign on the side of the hat. Oh, okay. Hey, puppy! Fuck that dog. Oh, my God. I'm telling Bogart. He... he, he yeah, yeah, this is him. Fucking cats. Yeah, what's this? This is a wonder. Who it might be? I see it's the Admiral, young boy, who's well helped the Zor boy for nary a single roofie. Just what is it you want, lad? A physical? You have some money, don't you? By the way, that girl, Ilya, didn't mention Keck text cut off. <sighs> I'll be honest, lad, it'll cost you a fair bit. It's not that I'm having trouble making money, not at all. I'm so skilled, they call my hands the golden nits. If you don't have any air in here, then be gone, you scoundrel. Did she really not say anything at all? Like, that, that always... Like... Show him the invoice. Oh, right. That's... I forgot about that. I have that. Here. What? What? Fixed it. I had to target him. Oh. Yeah. Ah! Look, I can't pay this off right now. Where, I don't know where this accent's going. Sort of heavy to strong army. Look, lad. So the wooden statue that young lady had. If I'd been able to sell the wooden statue, wouldn't I would have been able to? I accidentally spilled medicine. Oh, that's that's it. Thank Instantly. So you have to find the medicine and you use it to track down the statue. Look, Mister Hebby. Uh, nor the carving is here, so I can't repay you. And uh, the crate's right there. You can see because it's got the stink lines and everything. Why is it that it's always gotta be something smelly? Like, why can't it be Link acquired the scent of roses? <laughs> well, because roses really smell like poo poo poo. <laughs> you never heard that song? No. Ah, oh, I'm glad I haven't. It sounds dumb. It is. Like, Link acquired the scent of hmm. fresh cut grass. Link acquired the scent of. Freshly peeled oranges. Well, he he did once find the scent of the children. Are you saying the children smell sweet? Why are you smelling children? Oh, you're a creeper. I don't want to do this anymore. I'm uncomfortable. You're creeping on what? Where? What people? That person. Damn it! What do you mean, you people? Oh my god! All these Hylians with their pointy fey ears. Damn it. And their Faye pointy ears. Faye is a great descriptor. Come on. Cats aren't gonna rat you out, right? Right. Cats, you framed me? Wait. Oh, now they're getting freaked out by Wolfie. Whatever. Disrupt their circus. You knave. What? Tell me this doesn't just lead back to tell. You're looking for the wooden statue that Ilya had, aren't you, dear? Think it's a coincidence? No. I took it, but then I was. Oh, this is where you have to go. Oh God, we have to wait for nighttime. Shit. I don't know why those beasts were after a statue. Fiends lurk at us outside Southern Gate. Unfortunately, they only come out at night. They always move. Around. They mostly come out at night. Mostly. Oh, God, I think I just broke my ankle. You stupid. I'm trying to sit on my foot. Why?
Well, sorry, I'm just trying to add energy back. <laughs> Did it work? Oh, at least it's uh, almost. It's night. late afternoon. Yeah. It's the thing that's not quite night, but almost that twilight. Way. Yeah. It's almost like we really are the Twilight Princess, Ellie. We really are the Twilight Princess of us. Ooh. A hookshot point? It is indeed. Maybe. What's up there? Oh, this is probably a double point. This is probably a point for that thing that we don't have yet. God, that's still not ambiguous. I am shitty. Gotta be closer. Okay, right. Oh my god, you're still not close enough. What are you ever gonna do? How? I swear I... Oh. That's fidgety. Can you Z-target it? Yeah. Uh, I don't remember. What's up here? You could get across, though. So, kind of dope. Getting into all sorts of shenanigans. <laughs> Bless you. Thank you. Shenanigans up here. Well, there's only one thing that's going to be able to cross this rope. Link can't, really can't cross Hell ropes? Hell no. Why? Well, because he doesn't have that fine. Oh no, why did I do that? Fine canine balance. Where are these punk ass skeleton ones? You have to go. Oh man, my voice. Uh, you have to go right over here, actually. And they attack in packs. And this is, I want to say, the only time we see this enemy in the whole game. Correct me if I'm wrong, which I probably am, because I'm pulling that out of my ass. I have no recollection of these enemies showing up any time but the present. Which is the best Switch. time, really. Got a fucking yellow rupee. And two blues. So we've come to the southern end of... What? Hyrule Castle's Gate. Fight off skeletal dogs. Who are involved with the statue business, so we can... Statue thieving business. So we can help the doctor get enough money to pay... To save Ilya, this is memory. I got That's the hiccups why. now. Yeah. That's absolutely not why. Yeah. Yeah. This is not going back to that jerk-off doctor. I'm gonna go fucking pawn it. Okay. Uh, how exactly is that gonna work out for you? This is probably a heart piece up there. That's where I'm going for it. Okay. And then you'll get 12 hearts. And then maybe you'll be able to fight Dark Nuts. Oh, you mean, I fancy, love how, you mean the fancy way. I love how the mortal draw does not kill the Deku Babas. Nope. Two and more. I love how that didn't fucking. Hyrule Castle, or Hy Hyrule Field, is a shit show after dark. It's also dangerous. Yeah, that's what I mean. Watch you get knocked off by a crow. Yeah, it's like, it's like, it's like hanging out downtown Trenton. <laughs> it's like Alan Wake. Oh, was it just nothing up here? No. You probably have to dig. You, this is gonna take forever. Just transform and dig. All right. Or do you have to pick it up? I don't know. Who oh, knows? You're right. It is. Ah, you gotta dig shit out. What the? What? This better not be a big cavern. This is. What the shit is this? I don't remember this. I don't know, but I. Ain't I think this is. is golden bug territory. I'll leave the tech tights alone. What the hell did I ever do to you? Uh, existed. Yeah, that's true. I see a chest in the grass. It's not. Oh, bees. What? Why would you do this? Yeah, just get attacked by all the bees. Okay, it's nothing. Yeah, this was a waste of time. Yes, it was. What an awesome diversion. God damn. Darn it. Oh, hey! The bees! Or... They fun. made a cool chest appear. After I was in the Thanks, water. Thanks, Beezus! Beezus. Beezus Christ. Beezus Christ. Thanks, Waspinator. Damn it! But I got... Oh, Beezus Christ, you're my enemy! Oh, I can fish down here, though. Oh, boy! Oh, boy! Oh boy! 
Creepy, son. Yeah, I know, I'm trying to bring the creep factor up here. I feel like I can do it. Yeah, I ain't fucking with you. Dude, man. that's a hideous screech. <laughs> fucking. Did you just say I'm not fucking with you and then fuck with it? Uh huh. Okay. Well, look at it dive bombing the ground. Mike, we got so much of the game left. I know. I cannot. This cannot be my deathbed. All right, so I'm heading I got back so to much Ilya, to or should I go talk to Telma? Um. Uh, I would go back to Telma or the doctor. The fucking doctor don't know what to do. He's trying to steal it. Oh no, go back to uh, Renato. Fuck him. Renato is nothing but helpful all along the way, except that he's a big stereotype. He is, and it's racist. It is, but so are a lot of things. Like, this is not even the most racist game that Nintendo's made. Have you ever played Punch-Out? Yes. It is pretty racist. Do you remember... You know what Soda Popinski's name used to be, right? No, what? Uh, Vodka Drunkinski. Oh, God. That's pretty funny. Yeah. It's racist. It's fun. But it's fun. They went, oh, wow, this is probably not going to fly over in America. Let's change that. Soda Popinski. Okay, Renato. We got, uh, this statue for you? What's this mean to you? Oh. Oh, God! What is this? Oh, God! You notice it's got the Sheikah eye? You notice what else it looks like? Uh, a wooden dildo. With spikes. Oh, kind of like that dangerous sex toy I looked up for some reason. I found some some awful, awful things. Um, what was that even inspired by? I don't even remember. Um, I found some doozies that would put the Annihilator XXL to shame. Uh, I found a cock ring that was an Iron Maiden. Ah. Uh. Yeah. When you when when you want the maximum of, of your freak zone, just in case your dick in spikes. Ugh. Oh, I don't even know. Uh the most dangerous sex toy I could find though is called the cannon. Do you wanna know why it's called the cannon? Please tell me. Because it is um an enormous butt plug shaped like uh, a Civil War era cannon. There was a picture of it next to a can of Coke and uh, what, a little 8 or 12 ounce can. That shit's disturbing. Um, for comparison, and the Coke can looked like a thimble. Oh, you know what? There was something I told you about a while ago, and I never, uh, and you said you wanted to see it, and I never showed it to you. I don't know what you're talking about, but, well, speaking of butt... <laughs> Uh, that, the, like, my brother has, has had his ears pierced for a super long time, and he was, he used to be into, like, stretching them out, his, the, the holes in his earlobes as far as he could. There was a point where I think, uh, he could get his index finger through there. Oh, hey! Hey, we're talking to a pona, this is great! Let's go to back to talking about sex toys. Um, yeah, he could get, he could get his, his index finger through his ear hole. Um... The butthole is not an earlobe, and it should not be tampered with in such ways. I understand your freak zones. You, whoever is the, the, the prospective audience for this butt plug. But come on! How big is it? I don't have the picture on my Kindle at the moment, but if you would like, uh, I will search that out for you. I really shouldn't be curious about this. You should, because it's awful. Oh. It is so bad. Uh, yes, the bottle is not meant to be tampered with in such immoral ways. And not immoral because, like, that's bad. From a moral standpoint. I'm talking myself in circles. Please don't try this thing, man. Um... While we're at it, I'm gonna clarify what we mean when we say freak zones, because you might get the wrong idea. Your freak zone is merely your fetish. Like, get your freak on. Your freak zone. Your freak zone is your fetish. We all have our freak zones. We all live inside of our very specialized 
sometimes very, very specific freak zones. And that's cool. That is awesome. I never fixed it. No, you didn't. Um, but if your freak zone is like a, 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 a 24 liter soda bottle size butt plug, you have health problems incoming. It's gonna be a bad, bad time for you. Damn it. Okay, you take you can take over this commentating. No. Nope. While I go ahead and look up this picture for you. I don't. Know. That makes me incredibly sad. Uh, so you do, because why would you not? Oh, the last thing on here is the Zelda timeline. Let's erase that with a butt plug. <laughs> with a butt. With a butt plug. Yeah. Up the butt. Turn, turn okay, on. so my search history on my Kindle now looks like Zelda timeline. Butt plug. Ganon butt plug. Ganon's butt plug. Yes, I'm sure they have it. I'm sure there's like some sort of Ganon dildo stick. I mean. Okay, Ganon. I mean, they ha they have the fucking elites plug. from Halo. What? Yeah. Excuse you've looked into this. Oh yeah. I Mr. I don't want I don't know if I want to see this butt plug. I still don't know if I want to see this butt plug. You nah, well you do. Not really. Let's see if I can find Oh wait, this is a paste bin. What the f no, get back from that. That's probably a bad thing. Oh, can I uh Yes I can. Oh, come on now. Yeah. Oh god, there's one by from a, a website called cumcanon.com. What? Uh, I don't want to click that link. Nope, 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 nope. This yeah, that's bad the bad time. link. No, um, why don't we go, why does this bring me a Bing, and why does Bing support such ungodly depravity? Let's go on over to Google. Because holy hell. Yeah, take over the commentating while I search this butt plug out. I know, I gotta go to the I can't line. believe we have gone five minutes on this butt plug. What? Yeah. Yeah. I don't think you go on a butt plug anyway. I'm Screw sure. it, I'm letting it rip from now on. That's also what ever, anyone who has ever used this has said. <laughs> Screw it, I'm letting it rip? Yes. What? Can you do the dildo? Do the dildo. Dildo. I can't wait till Mountain Dew expands into sex toys. I'm more curious about how you are like completely okay with the fact that I just used the word dildo instead of dildo. Oh, I know. I know what you were going for there. Come on now. Either somebody is calling me. Oh, that... someone. The FBI. Please stop I'm saying just... dildo. <laughs> Please stop looking this up. It is profane. It's like we're trying to monitor your, your your search history, and it's getting really difficult for some of us. Man, I'm giving some NSA guys a real, real rough time. I hope At least nothing know, is stop. happening in this episode, so if people want to just skip it, go for it. I'm Let that shit you. rip. Okay, no, okay. You have to hear these words and digest them. Zeus! By the way, individually... Because there are a total of five words in this one, and each one has its own flavor, its own bouquet of unpleasantness. So I don't know I'm just if gonna I wanna use the word dildo and flavor in the same sentence. Individually, Zeus, electric, urethral, sound kit. Here we go. The fuck? Yeah, I, I gave you proper <laughs> forewarning of- Holy shit! That and you like were still five shocked. Times, that is more than five times the size of that Coke can. Yeah. Oh my god. 